What is considered a normal blood pressure range for a 70-year-old individual? Hello and welcome to today's topic on understanding normal blood pressure ranges, specifically for 70-year-olds. In this video, we will dive into the key values that define healthy blood pressure for someone at this age. Remember, maintaining healthy blood pressure is crucial to avoid potential health complications such as heart disease and stroke. What is blood pressure? Before we get into specifics, let's understand what blood pressure actually is. Blood pressure is the force that your blood applies against the walls of your arteries as it is pumped around your body by your heart. It's measured in millimeters of mercury, mmHg, and is presented as two numbers, for example, 120 80ths of a millimeter of mercury. The first number is the systolic pressure, which indicates the pressure when your heart beats and pushes blood around your body. The second number is the diastolic pressure, representing the pressure when your heart is at rest between beats. Both these numbers are equally important in understanding your overall blood pressure health. What is considered normal blood pressure for a 70-year-old? Now that we understand what blood pressure is, let's discuss what is considered a normal range for a 70-year-old individual. The American Heart Association AHA, suggests that a normal blood pressure should read less than 120 80ths of a millimeter of mercury. However, as we age, our blood pressure can slightly increase due to changes in the body, so it's not uncommon for older adults to have slightly higher readings. For a 70-year-old, a reading below 130 80ths of a millimeter of mercury is still generally considered within a safe range. However, blood pressure that consistently measures above 130 80ths of a millimeter of mercury is classified as high blood pressure or hypertension. This means a person is at a higher risk for developing heart or vascular disease. What factors can affect blood pressure? There are various factors that can affect blood pressure. These include lifestyle habits, such as diet and exercise, genetic factors, and coexisting medical conditions like diabetes or kidney disease. Other factors include stress and certain medications. It's important to maintain regular checkups with your doctor to monitor any changes in your blood pressure. Remember, many people with high blood pressure don't have any symptoms, so regular screenings are key. So, to wrap things up, while the baseline for normal blood pressure is less than 120 80ths of a millimeter of mercury, it's not unusual for a 70-year-old to have readings up to 130 80ths of a millimeter of mercury. Any consistent readings above this range should be discussed with a healthcare provider. Thank you for joining us in this video. We hope it's been helpful in understanding normal blood pressure for a 70-year-old. Stay healthy, and remember, regular monitoring of your blood pressure is an essential part of maintaining your health.